What's up guys, Paul Richards here from the Stream Geeks. And in this video, I wanna show you how to live stream to LinkedIn and why it's such a big deal. In fact, I had the opportunity to interview some of the folks from Microsoft in charge of LinkedIn live streaming. And they gave me some awesome inside tips on how to make the most of the platform. Plus, I'm going to show you how to use Restream.io so that you can live stream your existing YouTube and Facebook channels and add LinkedIn to connect with all of your business to business LinkedIn connections, which are really so vital for businesses. So all of this and more is going to be coming up next. So we're gonna cover how to live stream to LinkedIn using Restream.io. First of all, in the links below, I'm gonna give you a link to where you can apply to become a LinkedIn broadcaster. LinkedIn live streaming is still currently in beta. It should be available to everyone soon. And you can apply at this link here. Once you do get approved, you'll see right here that you get that LinkedIn live streaming uh, button on the homepage of LinkedIn right there. So that's what I have and I'll be able to demonstrate it today. Now you can't live stream directly to LinkedIn the way you can with YouTube and Facebook. LinkedIn is using third-party partners like Restream.io, which allows you to live stream to up to 30 platforms at once. And it has really helped us grow our channel here at Stream Geeks. We always live stream to YouTube, Facebook, LinkedIn, and Twitch at the same time. Just remember, you got to stay in touch with all of those chat rooms and all of the people there that you're communicating with. But I wanted to talk a little bit about why LinkedIn is such an important platform, especially if you're in business and you have a good uh, list of connections that you stay in touch with on LinkedIn. First of all, 50% of LinkedIn members report that they're likely to buy products from a company that they engage with on LinkedIn. So this is a big deal. If you sell products and services and you're engaging on LinkedIn, LinkedIn live streaming is going to in massively increase the amount of things that you can and sell to your contacts. 80% of LinkedIn members want to connect with companies who help enhance their buying decisions. And here at Stream Geeks, you know, we're always talking about why you should be building a live streaming studio, why you should be helping customers on their buying journey. And these are just the facts from LinkedIn. You get 14x more views on your profile if you look professional with a professional headshot. That does transfer over to looking professional with your your live streams. Now, as I talked to LinkedIn, they told me about this viral engagement strategy. And essentially what happens is when you start live streaming, your first degree connections are notified in the newsfeed about your live stream. Now, as your first degree connections start to engage with your content, the second degree connections will also be notified. And this is the way things can go viral where second and then third degree connections start to get notified in their news feeds about your live stream. So it's super powerful, especially if you're connected with folks who might be connected with similar like-minded people in the space that you serve as a business. LinkedIn has over 61 million users in the senior level influencer area, and 40 million of these people are decision makers. 50% of LinkedIn traffic is B2B traffic, so it makes up 50% of all social traffic to B2B websites and blogs, and 91% of executives um, list LinkedIn as the top place to find quality content. Now, I got a chance to interview Jessica Chan, and I was so excited when I got the chance to do this. She said, they're empowering us to not only live stream to our personal pages but or our business pages, but also our personal pages as well. So anything that's authentic and has a great voice is can be used the LinkedIn platform to build your community. So there's two different types of you know, pages on LinkedIn, right? So we've got our pages our business pages, and our personal pages. So what works well? Well, on business pages, you can market products, answer questions, have real-time conversations, build community, get consumer feedback, and sell products. Now, on your personal page, you want to do some personal branding. You want to demonstrate your skills and grow your connection base 
Be authentic, show your authentic self, have real conversations, provide Q&A, and increase your visibility to the world. So again, this viral engagement thing is when your first degree connections go to second degree and third degree connections using the LinkedIn notifications available on the platform. So I'm very excited. I've seen this happen with some of our streams. You do want to try to get employees of your business or friends to engage with your live stream because that is how you get to second and third degree connections. And it really is awesome. So think about where the magic happens. This is where your company and your online community, your LinkedIn connections can combine to really make magic happen and spread this viral engagement. So it's really cool. It's awesome. And just remember, interactive content is what's working on LinkedIn. This is from Jessica Chan, one of my good friends who I got to interview. Uh, some of those videos are actually on our YouTube channel. And things that are timely. So an event that's happening, uh, something that's happening right now, uh, that tends to do really well on LinkedIn. Now, as you know, the difference between regular video and live video is you have that opportunity to get the live viewer engagement. And then through that live timely momentary thing, having the ability to maximize that social media exposure. So yes, you should create video for LinkedIn, but consider live video and try to get uh, approved as a live broadcaster because that will really expand what you are capable of. So with that, I want to show you guys how to use Restream.io in order to use LinkedIn Live once you are approved. So let's go over to my Restream.io dashboard. Now, this if this is the first time you've ever seen this, it's a really great platform for multi-streaming. I've already got LinkedIn added here, but essentially you can click that add button and add so many different types very easily just by logging in. And of course, LinkedIn is one of the options that says it's in beta. So if we go ahead and uh, basically add that, I have added my personal stream here. Now you can see this stream is offline. You can simply add a webcam, which is pretty nice. You can stream from your browser, but I, as you guys know, I use vMix here. So what I'm gonna do is I'm actually gonna start streaming directly to restream.io and boom, using the URL and stream key here that I popped into vMix, my encoder, it's gonna show up here. And now you're seeing kind of a picture in picture of this. Now I'm streaming here and all I gotta do is hit that toggle on button and boom, I'm streaming to LinkedIn. I can also stream to my Facebook page and then I can stream to obviously YouTube and other platforms. Now an interesting thing that's happening in LinkedIn right now is LinkedIn is also starting to offer events. And we all know that there's a lot of virtual events going on. So take a look at using LinkedIn events as well. Uh, Restream has a great tutorial on how to do this. You know that we do a lot with virtual events and you know LinkedIn, if you're doing a professional business to business event, live streaming directly to your event is a great way to expand your virtual events presence. So that's it for live streaming directly to LinkedIn. You wanna get approved, you wanna get a restream.io account, and it allows you to not only stream directly to the places that you normally go to, like YouTube and Facebook and others, but you can stream to LinkedIn and even use the new LinkedIn events feature. Linked below are the links we talked about your Restream.io link and the link to sign up to be a broadcaster on LinkedIn. Don't miss out on this opportunity. If you get access, if you use LinkedIn as a platform to engage with other business communities and members, uh, live streaming there, looking professional, has been a big win for us. Every time we live stream, I see those profile views on my LinkedIn account skyrocket. Um, a few times we have gone miniature viral where we've gotten hundreds and hundreds of viewers, which is more than we normally get. Uh, and it's just a great option to add to your community uh, outreach and marketing capabilities. All right, guys, you won't become a video production expert overnight. So don't forget to subscribe. Um, we're, ha we're happy to be a part of you. And if you have any questions, ask in the comments below. I always look at those questions. And if you want to see how to live stream from Zoom video conferencing, 
to restream, I was thinking about that would be a cool video. Uh, if you like to use Zoom and you want to stream from Zoom to LinkedIn, you can put restream in the middle. And if you want to see that tutorial, let me know in the comments below. All right, bye guys. Take care.